What's going on guys, Mitch from Panda Motors here and today we are going to be installing a screen protector on our 2021 Ford Bronco. So this was sent to us by our friends over at the OCD plug. Uh, it is a matte screen protector. It has a many benefits. Uh, it's gonna cut down on glare. It's also gonna cut down on fingerprints, leaving your touchscreen looking very nice and fingerprint free uh, without having to clean it. So uh, a few awesome perks. If you guys like this video and want to pick one up for yourselves, we now offer these and you can go ahead and pick one up using the link in the description below. So uh, the screen protector is going to come in a box like this. We're going to open it up. You're going to see a few things. We have our install kit and then we have the screen protector itself. So first thing we're going to do is make sure we have nice clean hands. So I just uh, just wash my hands to make sure we have a nice smooth application. And then the next thing is we're going to grab our install kit and gra grab the alcohol swab so if you've ever installed a screen protector on uh, your phone install process is the exact same way we want to make sure we have a nice clean surface for the uh, screen protector to mount to so let's go ahead and get started so we have this little alcohol swab swab I'm gonna go ahead and just give this a nice nice wipe this is going to go ahead and remove all the residue and oils from your fingertips just give it a nice good base for the screen protector to cling to all right we're going to go ahead and put that aside next thing we will do is take the included microfiber and we're going to go ahead and just dry it All right, next we're gonna take our screen protector and we're gonna go ahead and cut this label with the applicator just to uh, make sure everything is nice and smooth. And then we are going to unroll it. From here, you're going to take your soapy water mixture and you're just gonna spray down, get it going, spray down your fingertips. This is gonna prevent any oils from your fingertips uh, getting on the uh, screen protector and causing any smudges. So you'll see here that there is a ridge. You're gonna go ahead and just start peeling this back to expose your screen protector. Set that off to the side. Just lay this here on my lap. We're gonna again take our soapy water mixture and we're gonna go ahead and spray the screen. Uh, definitely be generous with this. This is going to allow you to position the screen protector how you want it. Perfect. And then the side we peeled is going to be the sticky side. So we're going to go ahead and just position it into place. Using little to no pressure uh, just to get it in position. And we're going to make sure that all the seams are equal on the sides. In fact, if you've ever seen uh, someone lay down PPF, this is a very similar process. Just making sure we've got equal edges exposed. Perfect, I'm pretty happy with that. So then on top, we're gonna take our soapy water mixture again, and we're gonna spray down the front. Being generous with it, you'll notice there's some creases and bubbles in there, that's completely fine. We will go ahead and work that out with our applicator. All right, with our screen protector in place and our soapy water on the outside, we're gonna go ahead and press firmly, wipe away the bubbles inside, secure it into place. All right, then we're gonna take our microfiber again and we're just going to wipe it clean. All right, there we have it. Uh, install is pretty simple, pretty straightforward. We now have a nice matte finish. Uh, we'll go ahead and get it fired up to show you the difference. And this artificial lighting, it's pretty hard to tell the difference, which is very good. Uh, doesn't reduce any uh, visibility or anything like that. Uh, we have artificial shop lighting here, but when we get out in the sun, get out on the road, 
uh, which unfortunately we have a pretty overcast day today, so we'll be able to show you that. Um, it should reduce glares, and it's got this nice matte finish, which is very soft to the touch. So, yeah, I think this provides a pretty nice upgrade if you're looking for something like this. Again, we offer it here at pandamotorworks.com, so you'll be able to get yourself one of these and install on your Bronco. Uh, right now, we only have the application for the 12-inch, but we are working on an 8-inch application as well, so be on the lookout for that soon. If you guys like the video, be sure to smash that like button. If you want to see more Bronco content, be sure to subscribe. And if you got a comment, feel free to drop it below. Thanks for watching.